Hello my darlings and welcome to my channel. Today uh, I want to do a reading for you about February events but since February already started I'm kind of late on this reading. I decided to do it a bit differently. <clears throat> so uh, instead of asking about certain aspects of your life uh, like love, career, health, um, this time I'm gonna ask three other questions which will be what will surprise you, what might upset you and what will make you happy this month, okay? So it could be related to anything so I will let you know um, what is it related to the most so you know approximately uh, what to wait, you know? Sometimes uh, when we know what might upset us, uh, will not upset us anymore uh, when it's actually happening because we are warned. And that's what I'm trying to do here in your reading to make you aware of possibilities that might happen that will um, actually protect you from um, negativity, from stress, from anger and uh, also I will let you know a little bit about what will make you happy and uh, what will surprise you actually, <clears throat> okay? <coughs> I'm sorry. So uh, we're gonna have three candles, three piles as usual. Pile number one will be this blue candle and I will light them uh, during the reading, okay? Pile number two will be this um, orange or a yellow uh, candle and pile number three will be this black candle. So uh, make your choice, one, two or three. And we are going to start with pile number one, whoever chose this blue candle. Let me light it for you like that. Well, hello pile number one, whoever chose the blue candle. Let's see. What will surprise you this month of February? What will surprise you? Some event, something you will hear or know. And look at that, Ace of Cups at the bottom of the deck. What is this about? Maybe a love offer maybe a kiss <laughs> what will surprise you here mm -hmm. okay let me confirm what is this one? okay okay and look what i have even though I shuffled, I think I, sh <laughs> I shuffled and two aces came out at the bottom of the deck. Wow. Okay. What will surprise you will have a double meaning to it right away. I have to tell you why. So um, the thing is, I just want you to see what I see here. Okay. Uh, the thing is that Something will fall apart in your life. Uh, for most, it's about love life, okay? So, you might be waiting on something or maybe you are in certain illusions about a person, right? For example, uh, this person will surprise you with their... Um, unexpected change of plans. Maybe you were waiting on them, they had to come, right? Let's say you had to meet, for example. I'll give you several examples here, okay? And Or you were waiting on them, maybe the distance, or um, maybe you were just had uh, some date had to happen here. But this person will uh, not make their promise. I'm not saying because they do it on purpose, for everyone is different, right? 
and you will get upset, right? You will get upset about it, you will be angry, you will be sad, uh, depressed about what's going on. But the universe, <clears throat> why is this a surprise? Because the universe doing that on purpose to you. The universe doesn't want you to see this person at a certain point of time where uh, the meeting is supposed to happen. The universe um, gives you another chance in love. So two possibilities, either the date or the meeting that you were waiting on will happen. It will happen, but, but maybe two days or two months later, because I have too many twos here, right? And whenever it will actually happen, it will be much more successful. Not just that, but you will get a big chance in love. So basically a change of those plans will only serve you for better. Okay, it's not, you thinking, at first you will think this is bad luck, but actually it's a good luck. For some reason, you will figure it out later on. When it actually happens, you will realize why it was postponed. For others, if you suddenly will break up with your person, this is for others, or so suddenly something doesn't work, the universe did it on purpose because new love come in your way, new person, someone better for you. So you don't lose your energies on this person because you have someone new, someone who can give you not just the Ace of Cups, but also Ace of Pentacles. It's like, you know, um, you thought this is, this is your happiness that's coming, you, you planned on, but your happiness actually in someone else's arms. You will be happy in someone else's arms. That's what I hear. And this will surprise you eventually. First, it will sur surprise will be negative, and then suddenly the surprise will be positive when you put uh, things together. Like you're gonna say, "Aha! Uh -huh, that's why. That's why this happened." And this will all, all everything, all of what I'm talking about will happen very fast. It's not like you have to uh, wait for years. No. But since we're talking about February, I don't. Uh, for most it will play out within this month but for others it might go up to two months as i said that's not for all okay but no longer than two, than two months you will see the event unfold itself okay that's the surprise very interesting uh please come back when this happens because i sense for many uh it's like <clears throat> it's like you know i'll give you an example here okay uh, metaphorically speaking let's say you always wanted to go um, to a water park I don't know why this example comes but whatever I'm channeling you always wanted to go to a water park in your city right but uh, first the weather wasn't right then uh, some plans didn't work out and then finally you made plans with your friends to go or your family and before you go, a day before or something, uh, <clears throat> something comes up, something got sick or uh, the park suddenly closed and you cannot go and you upset. For example, okay, it's more for kids. <laughs> That's what make uh, kids upset maybe. But anyway, and then two days later or two weeks later, uh, you get um, an invitation or you get some letter that you won a ticket to Disney World. And you like, wow, I didn't even plan that. I thought uh, I was upset about I didn't go to a certain park in my city, in my town, but now I'm going to a Disney World. What is going on? That's exactly <clears throat> how it will play out with you okay in your situation it could also be work related maybe you will lose your job you will be upset for some time but actually the universe will bring you um, a better paying job something much more better something you would never even think of again it could be a person that's coming into your life 
okay? Those kind of things. It could be related to anything, but more I sense love situation for some also job. <coughs> but for most, it will be related to some person. Could be an air sign or someone um, very serious. Maybe the universe will bring you a better person who actually will be more serious about you. Okay? And responsible. Wow, this is very interesting surprise. Now let's see what might upset you. Even though I already know what might upset you, but still, since I'm asking, what might upset you, pile number one, <clears throat> in, in the month of February? What might upset you? Mm -hmm. For some, it could be um, a talk with your parents that you're not gonna like or something you might disagree with your parents on something. You might be closed off or you might not talk for some time. <clears throat> but eventually you'll figure it out. For others, it could be work or uh, school related. Maybe you'll get a bad grade in some <clears throat> in some of your classes or exams, and but then eventually you will talk to your teacher or professor to figure it out. Uh, if it's related to job, maybe you'll get some uh, warning at your work or like let's say you did something wrong and uh, your boss will be upset about it. Uh, you're gonna feel that you're about to be fired, but no, eventually you'll figure it out as well. Because I have three of pentacles, something can be worked on. So whatever might upset you is not um, major here. Okay, something, uh, some disagreement uh, with person or people here. But you will figure it out, okay? That's what I sense. I don't see this as love related at all here. It's something to do maybe business, partner, work, job, school, parents, relatives, friends. Maybe maybe you will get to a disagreement with your friends and you're gonna feel, uh, <coughs> you're strongly gonna feel you don't wanna talk to them for a certain period of time because you might be upset. But then you will figure it out. Okay, and finally, what will make you happy here in the month of February, pile number one? What will make you happy? <laughs> mm hmm. Wow, karmic situation is unfolding here. Either you have karmic situation with a certain person and you end the karma. You kinda, you're not gonna be blind anymore. You becoming the empress, any gender. You becoming, uh, it's like you outgrow this connection. If this is a person, okay, that made you go into pauses, then made you happy and then left again and stuff like that. It was going and going because two cards talking about karma. But you end in this situation. If you were addicted to someone, you end in this situation of addiction, you release yourself, you free. And this will make you happy that you're not upset anymore. You don't uh, drain your energies for this person anymore, okay? But this person actually w might, would want you now, now it's like you changing. If before you worried about this person, now this person will start worrying about you. Uh, while you already kind of free. <clears throat> Emotionally, you will become free from a certain person, karmic person or a situation. If this is not your... Um, <clears throat> you don't have any karmic partner or you don't have any karmic situation here. It could also be related just to toxic people around you. Maybe it's your family, friends, relatives, uh, at work. You kind of releasing yourself from negative people that drained your energies, that made you upset, that um, didn't give you energetic exchange you releasing that somehow some reason uh the universe bringing you new uh events 
that will change the situation. Maybe you change in your workplace, maybe you change in your environment, maybe you move into another city or country or another neighborhood that will leave you from all of that because a lot of negativity going on, uh, a lot of toxicity going on within your surroundings that you will re you are releasing and the universe helping you here. Uh, so everything unhealthy leaves your uh, surrounding. Okay, and you free, you become free and this will make you happy because now finally um, you're not over emotional about people or situation that don't serve you anymore. You don't care about this anymore. You live in that. Yes, you live in the moon where um, things were uncertain. People maybe lied to you. People didn't tell you, uh, didn't give you any clarity. And here you get the clarity now and become more, much more stable. Could also be financially much more stable here. Let's say the clarity, or let's say it was about your work, job. You didn't get a clarity about will you get a raise or uh, will you change a job. Uh, yes, you become in the Ten of Pentacles, okay? For others, just for some, if a person from, a karmic person, right? Uh, before didn't um, <clears throat> give you clarity or uh, just wanted to be lovers. For example, this person now realizing they want to be your family because the karma is ending. It's an ending of a karma. And what happens after the karma ends, uh, it, uh, there, there are two ways. Either um, you completely separate or you become one, but in a healthy way. So um, everyone, for everyone is different. This is a general reading, but some clarity, some freedom from toxicity is uh, coming your way and this will make you happy because you will be much more um, free and happy emotionally here. <clears throat> emotionally, you freeing yourself from being upset, disappointed, uh, depressed yes it could be related to some person could be fire sign or just person um, that is related to this situation for everyone is different again yes you releasing those worries that you had sleepless nights uh, the tower you releasing your illusions and you finally becoming stable emotionally a uh, beautiful <clears throat> also financially for some again it depends what situation you're in okay beautiful pile number one i love it let me know comments and uh, <clears throat> i really like this pile very interesting here at least for me uh, <clears throat> i love you all guys thank you very much and i'll see you in another reading bye bye <laughs>
or maybe this is your new chance in life. I want to tell you, usually, uh, before many years ago, um, when <clears throat> tarot readers opened Ace of Pentacles, they ended the reading. Why? Because in order not to jinx uh, the luck that's coming your way. Okay, but since we are uh, in the 21st century, I'll, I'll continue readings, reading, but uh, just know that you will be very lucky this month. Very lucky, something very lucky coming your way. Could be money related, career related, love situation, health. But we'll see, what is this new luck that's coming your way? What is this about? What will surprise you? Will you win a lottery or something? <laughs> wow, Queen of and Six of Okay, pile number two. Look at that. You see, you see that? Okay. <laughs> wow, I didn't expect that. I'll give you several possibilities, okay? Because many people are watching. It's gonna be a bit emotional here right now. I already sense it. <clears throat> In a good way. What will surprise you, pile number two? Well, pile number two are very strong people, okay? In this pile, people were going through a lot. Uh, you were struggling a lot recently. Maybe uh, for few years of, uh, or maybe for many years, maybe few months, but this was very major for you. You have uh, been through a major transformation. You um been through things that you thought you would never survive it. It could be love related, job related health related you were fighting for your happiness and finally the fight is over with the world you closing this chapter or of misery and opening a new one with the empress uh, finally the universe gives you a chance to be happy what will surprise you this this month pile number two for major amount of people that watching 80% I sense, you get you finally getting happiness in love. The universe gives you a chance to, if you wanted to get married, the universe gives you a chance of a person that will make you happy and give you stability, marriage, happiness, house, kids, whatever you wanted. It's like a price for you for all the struggles that you've been through. This person that's coming, it doesn't matter if you already know them or not. This person will conquer you, your love. This person will love you a lot. This person will give you everything you deserve and you deserve a lot here, pile number two. You're gonna feel loved, cared for. You're gonna feel um, like you are a great match. You're going to feel that your hearts are beating together. This is not going to be pain anymore. There is no more pain. You live in the pain. If you're right now in toxic relationship, this is not the person that's coming because this person that's, um, that will give you all of that is completely free of toxicity. This person uh, will not give you struggles. This person is here to save you. Okay, if right now you are in love with a person that's very light energies, very bright, uh, smiling a lot, giving you happiness, even if you just met, then it might be this person. But if for others who right now are in toxic relationship or connection, this is not this person, this is someone new. What will surprise you that such person uh, exists? <laughs> because you're not gonna believe it. You're gonna think this is a dream. You're going to think that um, something's fishy here. Why I got this um, such person in my life? 
Did I deserve it? Yes, you did. This Ace of Pentacles at the universe hangs you uh, to your hand to give you uh, this happiness and possibility to be loved and to love. It's going to be equal. It's not like the person will love you and you kind of not or uh, the other way. No, this will be mutual love. Like uh, you're going to have similar energies. Also, this person energetically will match you. You're going to have a great match. Like when you're together, you're going to match. Maybe you're going to have similar interests. Maybe not. Doesn't matter here. But this is your prize for all the struggles that you've been through. Someone might be crying right now. Why? Because you didn't expect this, right? In this reading. But it's coming. That's what will surprise you. Maybe not surprise you anymore. Because you know some of it. But still... The way this person will uh, come to you and start communicating with you and conquer you, your love, will be very surprising to you because you never had such person in your life. Personality of such person never appeared in, on your path. Uh, it's completely new energies here, bright energies, healthy energies, okay? This is for those who um, struggled with love recently, okay? For others, yes, justice is coming. Uh, this is fair. That's what you deserve. Justice is coming your way. You deserved it. So just accept. Um, I'm sure you will. And for others, if you're not looking for love or you're already in a good relationship, it's not what concerns you, right? Currently, if this is a money situation, financial situation, and you were always struggling financially, uh, it was never enough. Not because you are greedy and you want more and more, because you always worried about finances. It was always on your mind. Not because you wanted to be on your mind, but because you actually struggled. You couldn't uh, buy things that was necessary for you, not the things that are, uh, you know, expensive, no. But things that were necessary at certain point of time, maybe you couldn't go to a certain doctor because you didn't have uh, enough money. I'm talking about your past right now, okay? Could be recent past, it could be for many years you're struggling. Uh, let me tell you, from now, you're going to feel a major change in your energies when it comes to finances. The universe hanging you this pentacle to be financially abundant. You're going to have enough now to live your life without thinking about money. I'm not saying everyone will be a millionaire here, even though everything is possible, right? But what I'm saying is the universe giving you a chance not to worry anymore about finances you becoming financially abandoned enough to worry about other things maybe love maybe a hobby that you never couldn't start because you always have to work or you always have to search for uh, some um, financial stability you live in this you becoming free from it You might even start new job uh, or new um, hobby that will make you happy. Emotionally, you're going to be uh, very energized. It could be some person will offer you something and you will start making money. It could be, but more I sense this is you. You becoming financially abandoned. You are the one. It could be your spouse if you like together. It doesn't matter who, uh, where is the source coming from. But you would want to feel free now. Now you shouldn't worry about those things. Beautiful. That's what will surprise you. Uh, and what, what might upset you, pile number two? What can be here that might upset you? What might upset you? Hmm. Okay. Mm -hmm. 
I'll tell you what, and look, I have justice again. Uh, it seems like pile number two, justice is coming your way in all, uh, in all directions. Like karma is coming your way. For most, it's a good karma, okay? Uh, it's like you've been through something and now uh, you're receiving. First, maybe the universe took from you because karmic exchange, right? And then now it's flow, flow. Everything is flowing your way now. And even situations that you're not gonna like are eventually will be good for you. So what I wanna say, uh, what can flow to you here? A certain situation that might upset you. A certain person that was within your surroundings could be your best friend, could be your sister or brother, could be, um, some a colleague from work or um, someone who are like next to you most of the time so the universe is kind of taking this person away from your life why because your karma is done here you already been through stuff Yes, um, I'm not saying this is the best friend that you love and you, you're not going to worry that you're going to lose your best friend. No, this is someone that you already felt no good for you. For, for uh, uh, the latest time, uh, you kind of felt that this person is negative. Maybe your interests are like falling apart, like uh, going different ways. Uh, maybe you before you were thinking alike and now you don't not really okay but some person is shifting away the universe shifting this person away from you but this is for good this is for good why because new friend new um maybe colleague or whoever it is is coming your way even if it's your relative uh, I'm not saying new relative is coming your way. I'm just saying, even if this is your relatives, it's just you're going to feel that you're not that close anymore and that's okay. The universe tells you that's fine. Right now, this person shouldn't be too close to you because your karma is changing. Your um, surroundings, energies are changing and this person should go. It could be a man or a woman here, but someone who were close to you for some time, you actually maybe already used to this person around you, but now this person is no good for you anymore. So this person is going away. For some, it could be a love situation. It could be someone maybe you were talking uh, romantically or you had a romance. This person is going away. Why? Because remember in the beginning I told you new person is coming your way. It could be everything old, something, someone from your past will stay in your past. Maybe you will still communicate, but this communication is not going to be as it was before. And the universe tells you, this is fair. You don't need those energies around you anymore. Leave it. So whatever goes away from you, don't fight it. You don't have to do anything here. It's going to just flow away uh, uh, like uh, in a balanced situation. Like you're not going to feel straight like somebody will uh, betray you or some you will argue with this person. I don't see any arguments here. I don't see any situation that will make you upset uh, that um, will be very sharp. No. It might make you upset over the road. Why? Because you're going to feel you kind of not as close together. That's what will, will upset you. But it's going to be very balanced. Um, however it's going to happen, you'll be very slow and balanced. You're just going to like a little bit, little bit shift apart. Wow, interesting. And finally, let's see what will make you happy here. Even though in the first question we already saw, but what will make you happy in the month of February? Mm -hmm. 
why it will make you happy. Wow, pile number two, you rock. Okay, uh, let me tell you that someone from your past will suddenly appear and let you know that now they want to be with you on a, in a long term because before they broke your heart they uh, hurt you so many times they left you alone for uh, for long then they uh, they were never serious about you this person and you knew that and it broke your heart in the past this is for those people okay i'm telling if you know who i'm talking about okay you struggled so much with this person and guess what what will make you happy this person suddenly will make a change towards you this person will ask you to be with them on a, in a long term it's like your wish coming true but what what will make you happy and what will be a change here that when they do it at that moment when you hear them to say it or do something your way something serious you will say no to this person for most of you why because you already have another choice and this choice that's coming from the first question what will surprise you you realizing that you dreamed about this person but it was not not something that will make you happy eventually because either you already met the person you want to be with or you will realize that you don't want this anymore that you have may have other choices that you believe that your person is someone else somehow you have this realization that wow you might tell this person wow i, I waited for this so long but when it's actually here i don't want this anymore because i believe i deserve something more and you do and this will make you happy you finally free from this person you finally free from ex expecting for something serious from them because you uh, during this time you were uh, hurt you have grown spiritually energetically emotionally you grown and this person is not at your level anymore they still down there but you already look at you you have choices now if before they chose you or people in general chose you and you kind of okay somebody is interested in me that means uh, i have to be with this person or like you you were dream dreaming about people who were interested in you now it's shifting now you have choices and you choose who may be with you in a committed relationship so you turn the cards the table around and even if you need to wait for such person even if you don't know such you gonna deep down you realize you know what maybe i don't know who is gonna be my future spouse or who will be with me for a long term but i know for sure that i don't want to be with this person because out, I outgrown them. My desires now are much bigger than this person. And this will make you happy. The realization of your own worth. The freedom of uh, waiting on someone to choose you. Now you are choosing. For most that's how you're gonna feel here and that's what will make you happy yes now you have choices wow now you have choices in love who you want to be with look at this and uh, after when you realize that new people will enter your life but those people will be on your level now those people will be much more mature 
uh, much more serious choices choices you choosing now who you want to love beautiful um, and definitely new people Russian euro maybe you already know a person who you want to be with but this is not this one okay or you just know you are very intuitive here pile number two and I'm so happy for you guys thank you very much let me know in comments how did you like the reading I love it so far two piles already I love it like very emotional <laughs> Uh, but in a good way. Thank you guys and I'll see you in another reading. Bye bye. Hello pile number three. Whoever chose this black candle. Let me light it for you. Who is crying here pile number three? I see a tear coming down. What are you worrying about? Not for all but some. Let me see, <clears throat> what will surprise you, what will make you upset, and what will make you happy this month? Let's see pile number three. So what will surprise you this month? interesting so right now pile number three not in a really good mood or energies something's going on in your life uh, something has to do with love first of all okay this is first message I get here so I see that you are um, waiting on some person Maybe not waiting, but still thinking about some person that's very toxic, that's no good for you. Uh, maybe this person uh, uh, always tells you that they will come. Maybe you're the distance, then they'll come to your city. They want to see you. Maybe it's an internet um, connection online. Or it's just this person's always telling you that they will do something or they're planning, but those plans never come to reality hmm. one second I want to confirm something here why um, and this person always leaves you um, in uncertainties they come, come and go hot and cold maybe betray you or hurt you every time with their silence and then they come back this is very toxic here okay uh, not healthy relationship or connection could be karmic here as well but you still kinda hoping that this person maybe open up with their feelings or maybe do something about it still hoping and that's probably why you watch this reading uh, even though it's a February reading, you kind of wished that this person will come out in your reading, okay? You want a family with this, you want happiness with this person, but this person seems to be very toxic to you. If this is not your situation, don't, don't watch or maybe later I'll look what else will surprise you because this part that might be not yours. But for those who it resonates with, this person lets you down, your energy is down. Yes, this person drains you. Uh, but let me see what will surprise you then about this person. Why? Why it's a surprise? Because you kind of already know this person is not giving you what you want. Uh-huh. <laughs> Interesting. Uh, for some you get a meeting with this person you see this person physically for others this person might open up with their feelings to you but this is not going to be major 
it's just like uh, they might even say it but they're still gonna be a bit stiff with it like they're not completely opening to you but this little change will make you um, will will surprise you it's like you didn't even expect this from that person and you will see a little change in them uh, that they kind of changing towards you um, but you wouldn't trust this completely for some you might even cut off this person because you might think they're coming again to you know drain you or to get just for you to be lovers to have sex and stuff like that you're not trusting this person very uh, similar to karmic connection here uh, but this will surprise you their move some of their move yes will surprise you maybe they're coming to your city or country maybe they're uh, would invite you to their home yes a person from your past you know this person uh, you already had a history karmic situation could be soulmate karmic you also know this person is very manipulative but you're still kind of waiting uh, you know uh, this person needs to completely transform in order for you to be together but you still have patience for them uh, but um, the more you hurt from this person, the more you grow, the more you learn in your worth, you uh, realize in your worth. This is your lesson. This is karmic lesson here going on. What will surprise you? This person will uh, appear. If you were in a pause, this person will uh, reappear or tell you something that you didn't expect from them. But would it be a major change? No. It still will surprise you about this uh, person from your past is coming back. Uh, long story short, okay? Uh, I don't want to look too much in it because the energies are no good here. Uh, I don't like it right now. No offense to anyone, uh, but uh, guys, you, you're in a karmic situation here if it resonates with you. Yes, and it's to do with your karmic soulmate. Yes, there is a change in them, but is it major change? No, not yet. But you're still patient with them. It will surprise you that they're coming again. They will uh, suddenly come, especially if you're in a pause and you didn't talk for long, this person is coming back because this is karma, okay? For others, what will surprise you if you, it has nothing to do with you or maybe something else, what will surprise you? Mm -hmm. Uh huh. For others, if you uh, <laughs> this person doesn't leave your uh, energies because karmic, you know, they're always near you, their energies. Um, so you're both struggling here. Okay, for others, if you were planning to go to a certain trip. Uh, and it didn't work out, maybe because of uh, pandemic roads were closed maybe you didn't have a chance finally you're getting a chance to do this uh, whatever you planned for some plans that you had before are actually coming to life now maybe some woman will help you in it or maybe your mother maybe someone will help you to uh, make those plans happen maybe a person had to come to you and it didn't work and now finally this person is coming maybe that's the same person but not for all it's just like something that was postponed will actually uh, come to life. This month you'll, you'll hear news that you can actually go somewhere. Yes, some roads that were close to you recently, some trip, something you wanted to do. It doesn't have to be exactly different countries or cities, but something that needed to wait actually coming back. person or situation here and this will surprise you this will surprise you here yes finally energetic exchange here the universe gives you back whatever you uh, couldn't do before okay and what might upset you what might upset you this month
<laughs> what might upset you that this this will end eventually this uh, thing that will surprise you is not for long or a person if you waited waited on a person and it will surprise you right um, this person is not coming for long they may leave again because this is come and go situation and it might upset you that things will not work for long you will be happy for some time but it's not going to be for long for others uh, what might upset you that something to do with your family maybe um, yes could be your mother or father maybe someone will need to, <clears throat> maybe either someone will be separated from their parents house maybe you gonna go and live in another city or country it might upset you because you're gonna miss your family if you're going to live in another another uh, city country or just apartment you, you will miss some people here so what might upset you you missing people that were around you before or a person uh, your love situation you will miss this yes uh, you will miss someone this month uh, because someone is uh, going away <clears throat> and this will upset you a bit but not like you're going crazy here uh, no it's just you're gonna feel this longing for a person or people yes because with the chariot someone is leaving or you leaving some living situation it's like you got a chance to see someone and then you leave. Maybe you visit in your parents and you be together, you happy, but then you have to leave again. So it's a short uh, happiness, I want to say here. And this might upset you, but this is, a, this is okay. This is a, not for long. This is maybe four or five days you'll be, you know, upset. And then it's, it's gone. I don't see anything like major or crazy. Yeah, you regain your energies very easily after that. And finally, what will make you happy this month, okay? What will make you happy, actually happy this month? Mm -hmm. Okay, if this, this, this time this is work related. Uh, if you were looking for a job, long term job, good paying, you're getting it for a long term. If you had certain competition, you win, you will win this competition. Maybe it's about your hobby, your work. For example, you're an artist and you, um, you know, compete with some, someone like at the gallery and whoever wins the prize of, let's say, five, ten thousand dollars, you will win the prize. That, that, those are things, you know, uh, this will make you happy. It's going to be like, um, positive flow something you worried about will make you happy so your worries about this situation will make you actually eventually will come out good or you find a new job here or you um, have a raise here at your work you're changing departments whatever maybe your business will start giving you uh, pentacles look at that uh, major flow of pentacles coming here and the universe uh, gives you that because you deserved it. Yes, I just said you deserve the justice. Justice is coming your way when it comes to finances here. Definitely. This will make you happy because and maybe that's why you are going. Maybe that's why you're going to see your family this month or you buying tickets to see them after this month. Uh, because you want something or you had a raise or you want money i don't know now you have the funds to do what you couldn't do before that's the main message of this month to you beautiful something that bothered you were waiting on maybe waiting on finances to go you actually going with the chariot beautiful um give your thanks to the universe because the universe uh, made this happen of course god your angels help you here uh, so you can actually accomplish something something you couldn't do for long very interesting someone will go to their yeah to their uh, parents house or meet their family 
Aha, others will go to their loved one who they didn't see for a long time. Maybe you had a distance. Um, yes. Beautiful. Someone is, if you are lovers with someone and you didn't see your lover for a long time, either you coming or they're coming your way, but this will be a short term, as I said, and that's why maybe it will make you upset afterwards that it wasn't for long. Because they have to leave again, maybe for work, uh, or you have to leave for work. But you will make other plans with this person or people uh, that later you can see each other again. But financially, you will be very happy this month. At least by the end of this month, you'll get some news about financial growth. Job work related, okay? Business related. Pentacles come in your way, pile number three. And this will make you happy, which is very, very good, okay? Thank you very much. Don't cry, nothing to worry about. Whatever happens, um, eventually will be for your own good. Thank you very much, guys. I love you all, and I'll see you in my other video. Bye-bye.